Hi, welcome to Rhonda Said. I'm Rhonda and I love saying things and we're all mad here and I have a thing for Alice in Wonderland. I always wanted to be her as a child, especially the Disney cartoon. I loved that so hard. It was so psychedelic and cool, but I didn't know what psychedelia was as a child, but I appreciate it as an adult. <laughs> So I welcome you here to my channel. If you're new, welcome. If you're a regular, welcome back. Looks like my brow. Why is it I never noticed till I press that record button that my brow is crazy. It looks like I just smeared dirt right across it. I don't know, but I'm here today. And thanks to my special best friend in the freaking universe, Candy Sass. I got a new palette to play with this week and it is the fruit pie filling from you can be and we love this little Chinese company they make fantastic palettes and it is oh yeah you can tell I've already touched it I've touched it touched it in a very special way anyway so this palette is very cool it looks very similar to the Morphe Jeffree Star palette but it is not an exact dupe, but it is definitely inspired by. Let's see if I can handle all this. So you can see there's some differences in the colors and the different rows, but it's definitely got a lot of inspiration and some there's some very similar things in here, but it is not an exact dupe for the Morphe palette from Jeffree Star, which I actually like quite a bit. A lot of people kind of poo-poo it, but I don't think it's that bad. I think it's pretty good. Me likey. So we'll put that away since we're not gonna do a swatch for swatch comparison, but we are gonna swatch this bad boy. And it's got 28, wait, 32 shades. That's six times four, six times four is 24 plus six is 30 30 shades 30 shades i can't do math man i did not have a math degree in school i just feel good that i just even worked it out just now but let's get to swatching and i'm not going to read all these names because it takes forever for me to read because because i'm lazy i'm lazy i'm lazy but anyway uh Let's get this first row going. That's a pretty shimmer. And these palettes usually perform really well on the eyes and swatches aren't usually too bad. And I would be able to make a heck of a look. Um, I think I'm gonna do one look on one eye and another look on another eye just to mix it up a little. They always swatch a little better when my fingertips are a little moist from the facial cleaner. Ooh, that's a little shimmery. That's a nude color. Swatch a swatch a swatch a swatch a swatch a. I'm a swatch a swatch a swatch a swatch a. Um, I watch. What's his name? can't think of his name but there's a guy who's got a swatching song it's like it's swatching time yeah I can't sing like that I can sing goofy songs that I make up but I can't do like a big grandiose run so Nady that's his name Pop Lux he has a it's swatching time that's my imitation <laughs> Oh my god, it's so funny. Uh, did I get all that? I think I did, so let's go to this next row. That's a shimmery gold. Put it this way so you can see that shimmer. It's pretty. You can see up and down my arm. And 
And then the last two in this row, we'll put right up here. Because this is a lot of colors and I'm almost out of skin. So please forgive me. Please forgive me, I know not what I do. Oh, what, Wolfie, you don't like my song? But these shimmers in here are awesome. Those are beautiful. And we're getting close to the end. It's a purple, it's kind of patchy, but purples are real hard to do. So I'm not mad at it being a little patchy. And we're down to the last row. This is a beautiful shimmer. I love greens. I'm gonna have to do something with that shimmery blue. Look at that. amazing and the darkest for last so it swatches pretty good pretty good I'm gonna clean my arm up so I don't look like a rainbow there's nothing wrong with looking like a rainbow but I don't know some of these are hard to get off shows they got some staying power Woo! Almost rubbed my tattoo off with that one. Not really. I was kidding. My tattoos don't come off. These colors don't run. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to start my right eye with uh, this color it says melon but it is really just a creamy beige do you like that color wolfie you just want to talk when you want to talk you don't want to give mama no fun no fun from wolfie but he's awful pretty jesse is in here too and louie all the cats are in here but they're being good which is crazy and won't last long. I'm going to take this Sigma blending brush and go into this peach color. So I think it's super pretty. Look at that. It goes right on that brush super nicely. It's got a nice soft payoff to it. There is some kick up in the pan. This is like a $10 or $11 palette. And I don't mind the You Can Be. There's been some controversy about You Can Be makeup, but there's a lot of makeup people buy that's from China. And this stuff is usually pretty good for the price. And you know, I'm willing to take a crapshoot just to have some fun with some colors. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna kind of stay in this row and go with the orange. give it a neon look very pretty so I've got a big wash of orange um, I do love the orange pinks and purples and stuff let's go into this yellow in the corner here which is called mango, and mangoes are not yellow. But that's okay. It's looking super cute though. And I just keep using my color swatcher to get the color off the brush. I'm gonna go into lemonade, the shimmer here, and go under my brow. I'm thinking about what I'm going to do. Woo, that is a nice shimmer. The shimmers are usually really good in these palettes. 
And like I said, I'm gonna do one eye and then do the other eye completely different just for something fun. A little crazy, a little wild. Wild, wildlife. I think I'm going to go into this pink here, which is called Wax Apple, which doesn't have make any sense. Let me go right here in the center. So it looks pretty with this yellow and orange. And I'm going to go into this raspberry purple. Oh, it's not showing up. It's a shimmer. Let me see if I, if I use my finger. Oh no, that's not working. That's some straight up garbage color. It was worth a shot. So we'll go into this color called Grape. That's not going. Sometimes you can't build color on color. This is looking like just another pink. Let's see what I can do. Let's see what we can do here. Got a little carried away on the outside of my eye. Let me get a blending brush going. It's pretty. I really wanted some purple, but there's a purple here. I'm gonna try hitting it with that purple. But it blends out really pretty. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted. Pretty. All right. Let me get that blending brush out again. That purple just kind of blends away. There go. But it's a pretty tropical eye. Let's see what we can do with some eyeliner. And this is my Too Faced Better Than Sex eyeliner. We'll do mascara at the same time. So we've got one eye done. Let me go and do my brows. And I thank myself every day for getting my brows microbladed. It makes it so easy. Just fill in the lines. Now, if I don't have makeup on, then you can see my brows really great. But when I put foundation and powder and stuff, it kind of, well, that one looks like it's going like in a completely different direction. Let me use a little fluff and fill brush. All right, that's much better. I don't want to look like I've got crazy, well, I'm going to look like I have crazy eyes anyway. But let's get going with a different color story on this eye. But this has turned out really pretty. 
and I am going to start with this is called Sapodia and it is a shimmery kind of beigey color and I'm just gonna put it in the crease I'm gonna actually brush it on the lower lid too because it's just so pretty. And I've got, I really want to use this color, so I think I'm gonna. And this color is called Dew and it's swatched so pretty. Let's see how it does with a brush. Not showing up very much with a brush, let me try again. Oh, there we go. You can see the shimmer in it. It's a very pretty color. Can you see how pretty that is? It's a whole different eye look. Well, that's what I'm going for. How many times am I gonna say, it's a different eye look? Probably a couple more times. And I don't do a lot with blues, but that's just so pretty. Um, I'm going to use the blender brush and blend that out some. I think, it added, I think I didn't get the purple off. Well, it's still pretty. Forgot to clean the brush. It's still pretty. Now I'll clean the brush. Poor Rhonda can't remember nothing because I'm doing two different eyes, girl. All right, so I'm gonna go into this pretty blue, which is called Ice. What wolf? Do you like this color? It's super pretty. Oh, Wolfie, what's up? He talks to me all day. Lily, where are you going? That's right, I saw you, kitty cat. You can't run from me. I'm your mama. But where should I go? There's not a lot of... It's like the blue option is kind of limiting. Let me get that blending brush out since I have cleaned it. Maybe that's just going to be the look. I'm going to... Get another brush. And I'm going to take this brush and go into lemonade, which doesn't look like lemonade. And I'm going to go into the brow bone, just like I did on the other side. have to go crazy every time I do an eye look. It's just pretty. And put some right here. Some shimmer right there. Kind of ice it out. Okay, let's do some highlighter and mascara. And then we'll figure out a lip that'll work for both. Probably not. And this is my Too Faced Better Than Sex Waterproof Eyeliner. I'm not afraid to say that I am an emotional girl. 
and um, I like waterproof eyeliner, so if I get a little teary, it doesn't go crazy. And I'm going to use my Hypnose Mascara from Lancome. And this mascara is fantastic. I get great length with it, great definition. I got it on a deal with another mascara and the Lash Booster from Lancome. Oh my gosh, so pretty. right eye always does better with mascara than my left eye. Maybe it's because I'm not ambidextrous. And that just looks so glamorous. Really? Stop climbing up my cubes! I've got one of those cube systems, and you just climb up the cubes. Like you do when you're Louie, you just climb up shit. All right, I'm going to do a neutral lip here with my L'Oreal number 822. So there we have it. Two completely different looks with one palette. I should bring it back over. And this is great. Thanks so much, Candy, for sending me this amazing palette. It has great payoff. And just look at the shimmers. And the mattes are good. I'm really pleased with this palette. And I hope you have a great day or the day of your choice. And we'll see you soon. Boop, 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 boop.